At this point in the video, the fitting has been installed using all the appropriate installation procedures. The plug has been removed from the ID of the fitting and the pressure test has been successfully completed. With the pressure test complete, place the valve and fitting adapter assembly on the VersaTap fitting. Turn the adapter counterclockwise until the thread engagement between the fitting and the adapter are seated. Then proceed to turn the assembly clockwise until hand tight. Apply the SureTap tool with the quick connect nut. Tighten the adapter with the multi-purpose wrench. Be careful not to over tighten and damage the plastic threads. Open the valve and push the shaft of the SureTap down until it makes contact with the main. Now lock in the collet nut, making note of the location of the graduated marks on the shaft. Using the multi-purpose wrench, begin turning the shaft clockwise. If the graduated marks move upward, the collet nut is not sufficiently tight. Back off the cutter by reversing the shaft and tighten the collet nut again. Turn the shaft until the positive stop is reached. At this point, you're through the main. Loosen the collet nut and hold the shaft. The gas pressure will push the shaft up, but the brake will hold it in any location when released. When the shaft is fully retracted, close the valve. Loosen the quick connect nut and remove the SureTap tool. You'll note that this company used its gas detector to confirm shutoff after the valve was closed. Now you are ready to connect the access device. Refer to the access device's manufacturer instructions for any additional specific installation requirements. When ready to remove the access device, close the valve, loosen the quick change nut, and remove the device. Now you're ready to replace the completion plug. With the valve closed, make certain the gasket is in place at the bottom of the completion plug installation tool. Then apply the completion plug installation tool with the plug in place to the top of the valve. Tighten the quick connect nut with the multi-purpose wrench. Open the valve. There will be gas pressure working against the insertion of the completion plug. It will attempt to raise the shaft of the completion plug installation tool. Press the completion plug to bottom out in the fitting. Turn the handle in a counterclockwise motion until a good seat is obtained between the plug and the ID threads on the fitting. Now turn the handle clockwise, maintaining downward contact between the completion plug and the fitting at all times. Turn the completion plug until it bottoms out on its seat. Loosen the quick connect nut and remove the completion plug installation tool. Check one last time for leaks. Then remove the valve and adapter using the multi-purpose tool. Carefully apply the cap by hand until tight. Do not use a wrench to tighten.